I guess we're getting some more exploration quests. Or exploration quests. Sheesh. Um, you know, points. <clears throat> There's nothing up here. I like how... This is where the house used to be, isn't it? The house that never should have been. I mean, really, what is what is it about unusually high and dangerous places that attract people? I like how there's um, arrows to point you, kind of lead you where to go. I didn't want to go. There we go. Um, I guess we go up. Let's go up. There they are. <clears throat> oh, and the house, the lighthouse is working too. Is that why you approached me back then? Yeah. What about now? I suppose it's just a part of it. Look, it was a long time ago. It's not too relevant now, but Izzy said I should tell you the truth. It shouldn't have tainted our first meeting like that. What is that? A hacky sack? Can you throw this as far as where Anya's at? I don't know. You want me to try? Would you? Okay. River! Are you insane? Get away from there! That's kind of odd. I think this memory isn't too far from the last. Think they may be connected? Probably. Where's the memento? Why does she cut her hair anyway? I like long hair. Everyone with it is different, John. Just because she and I share the syndrome doesn't mean we share the same head. But you must be able to help somehow. Everything was okay at first, but now she's even more aloof than before. Even now, we're in the same room, but she's never really there. It's starting to take a toll on me. I just don't know how to take it anymore. Well, I can't speak for her, but many of us do long for connections. Though, being able to articulate it is a different story. Just because she struggles to express it, it doesn't mean she doesn't feel anything. She's still there, right? Sometimes you just have to have faith that she cares. It's pretty difficult to do. Day in and day out. I know. Wait, but why do you see some normal, Izzy? I mean, don't you have the same condition? For one, I was diagnosed when I was still young. With effort, it's not impossible to acquire a, a guise of social norms systematically. But you know what? I both envy and pity River. Me, I'm an actress. 
because I've been doing it all my life. Not only on stage, but off stage, and at practically every moment. I've gotten good at it because acting is the only option I have. It's the only way for me to be normal. But River, she never did that. She remained an outcast and refused to learn to step against it. I don't know if it was by choice or by limit, whether bravery or cowardice. There are days when I just can't stand faking it anymore, and then I realize that it's too late. The Isabel that people know of is all an act, and the real me has long become a stranger. How sad. I think in the end, I just envy her. Huh. I've never met a woman with it before. Then technically, you still haven't met one. <clears throat> this isn't part of our business. Let's move. Alright. I think it's cool that you can see outlines of people, but since it's a memory... Since it's a memory, they can't really remember the actual people. They just remember that there's people there. There's River. Anything new today? No. What are you reading there? The Emperor's New Clothes. So that's why the book was there. I loved this when I was young. Still do, huh? Of course. Just for different reasons. When I was a kid, I loved the Animorphs series. I love the Animorphs. I know, your mother gave you a book from, from it as a wedding present. <laughs> yeah, that was one odd wedding present. I guess I was pretty obsessed with it when I was a kid. Why haven't you read them since? Hmm? I saw them. They're collecting dust in the in the garage. Well, I just grew out of them, I guess. I mean, they're children's books. What's wrong with reading children's books? They're comforting. I suppose so. I think I'm going to get this one. Hmm, so I need to get two more, uh, things. If I... We have to talk up here. Or talk to this lady? Or what? Talk to John? What do I do? There we go. Whoa. Um... I'm not yours. You're not mine. Be my anti-Valentine. Hey, River! This one's not that corny! River? What about David's? He's my favorite character. Uh, I don't know. What are you talking about? Animorphs? Have you read it? No. Yes. Really? Sort of. Oh, oh, do you know what animal is David's main morph? Um, no. Um. XXX9. <laughs> that doesn't sound right. Don't worry, I'll figure it out for you. <laughs> 